David, great to be here at Gloria once again for Legends Talk Q School. What does it mean to the resort to have this event here every year? No, it's great. We're very excited, uh, very proud to be involved, obviously, with the Legends Tour. Uh, the publicity we get to get so many good players coming here, it's something that our owners are very keen to be involved with. So it's something we look forward to hopefully having again in the future. Both course looking absolutely superb. Old course last year. We're on the new course this year. How does it differ from what the players it's, might be used uh, to? It's interesting. The new course in the big events we've had in the past tends to be two shots easier per round. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a little bit more open. It was eight years uh, newer than the old course. So the old course opened in 98, the new course 2007. So I think the players are finding it as well just a little bit uh, more forgiving than the old course. Although the scoring there was obviously one very good score, mm -hmm. uh, but then the rest of them around par one under, so it looks like it's going to be quite close. You know the course is like the back of your hand. What does it take to shoot a good score around oh, the new? Well, the new course, where most of the good players struggle is the greens. They, they overread them, uh, so it, it's getting the greens right. I mean, obviously, the standard hitting it down the middle on the greens, but it's the putting. Mm -hmm. And I think if you're interviewing some of the players this week, it's the same thing. If they, if they can get the greens themselves, if they feel comfortable on them, then they'll do well. Mm -hmm. they, they definitely overread them. Mm -hmm. The hospitality is great here as well. The course is, as we said, presented in brilliant condition and still pretty early in the season as well. Just give it a, a bit of an insight into what goes on behind the scenes to get everything ready the, for this week. Really, it's just preparing the tees and the greens. So we've managed to get the greens in good condition for the tournament. Uh, that's the key thing for us. You know, the guys working for two or three weeks beforehand. Well, I'm going to put you on the spot a bit now. So we've got one round in the books already as we yes. sit here. Six under was leading after that. What do you think the winning score will be and what will be needed to get in the top five and get your card? I would think the winning score is going to be 13, 13 under. Dependence on the weather tomorrow, of course, but I think it's going to be very tight. Mm -hmm. 10 under, 10 to 13. And you think for that fifth card? card? 10 under. 10. OK, we'll hold you to that going, and come back I'm to going it. sort of optimistic, is that the word? <laughs> I like the optimism. The standard here has been really good all week, yeah. so I think you're not going to be far off. Yeah. David, thank you for having us. No, Brilliant thank resort, you. wonderful golf courses. We're having a great week. Thank you very much.